the Bucknell women's soccer team is set to play Robert Morris on Friday night at Emmett Field. The last two games have been tough, but senior Cassie Denger explains how the team stays optimistic. So it's definitely important that we stay together as a team and we use our team chemistry off the field to kind of build ourselves back up on the field. Uh, coming off of last year's Robert Morris game, we were really disappointed with the result and I think we're looking to kind of get that revenge on our home turf, definitely with the stated goal of being above 500 um, and defending our home turf. After playing games on the road through the end of August and a home game on Tuesday, Coach Ben Landis talks about what his team has been doing in practice recently to regroup. This week our focus has mostly been recovery. Um, today, coming off a day off from yesterday, being off, I'm excited to train. So we'll get back to things that we can do, our movement on and off the ball, and our finishing. Those are things that we'll focus on for tomorrow night, especially. The team has a one and one record against Robert Morris over the past two years. Coach Landis said he is more focused on his team's performance than that of the opponent. Well, we're, we're keeping most of our focus on us. Um, we have a tough time playing there for whatever reason, but we also have always played them well here. Mm -hmm. So being at home is a good thing. Um, I think keeping our focus on us and what we need to do is a good thing. I always expect Robert Morris to fight for 90 minutes. I think that they might not see the ball the whole time, but they're always going to give their full effort, especially on the counterattack and their goalkeepers are always well prepared. And so we need to be able to stay the course, make sure our shots are in frame, we're following shots and crashing the goal and finishing our chances when they come. The women's soccer team is hoping to pull off its second victory this Friday night. The game will be played under the lights at 7 p.m.